So hey y'all, my camera is charging. Um, I was just recording off of there. Basically telling y'all welcome to Vlogmas Day 14. Um, I'm just kind of doing my face wash. There's barely any face wash left because I just rinsed it off. But I was just kind of, you know, doing my morning face wash routine or whatever. I woke up late because I was up late. Um, but I've been up for a good amount of time. I've been up, like, for a long time. I only slept for a few hours, but I'm up. I'm trying to get this skincare, baby. So tomorrow I have a meeting. Um, and I'm going to need to, like, pick out what I'm going to wear or whatever. I'm going to get it out today. That way... It'll be prepared for tomorrow. I don't have to be last minute trying to figure out what I'm, a, I'm aware. Um, just to make sure everything is together. I might do my hair. I was thinking about actually putting my hair in a bun. But I don't know if I'm going to retwist it or I'm going to just put it in a bun or if I'm going to wear it down. I'm not exactly sure yet. It all depends on the outfit, um, honestly. If you don't wash your face with a face washing brush... I suggest you do it's definitely a game changer I've been using it for years like face wash brushes game changers in my face wash routine all the time like you can be having breakouts throughout your week and get your face wash brush out and watch you'll notice that breakout will start to disappear like something about you know they get into those pores and the crevices and stuff like that but yeah so my camera like I said the battery is charging I got some things on my to-do list to do today. I need to write out some more goals. It's just been frustrating. Um, I've got I've had a lot on my plate and a lot of like deadlines, due dates, pay this, pay that. Like it's just been it's been a lot, y'all. Um, obviously, I'm participating in Vlogmas, but I just kind of been chilling and just trying to handle my business literally, stay off the grid or whatever. So. But yeah, y'all, let me get, get through this face wash routine, and I will check back in with y'all in a little bit. Hey, so I decided that today I'm just going to vlog off of my phone instead of my camera because I feel as though it'll be an easier upload. Like, when it's time to actually upload Vlogmas Day 14, I could just upload it from my phone instead of uploading it from the camera because, like I said, I have to put in the work for the camera, but my battery is, like, charging and your girl don't have time to be waiting all day for it to you know like be fully charged to function i mean it is my fault um because i should have charged it last night i'm trying to throw away stuff and put up glasses my wine glass be everywhere um face wash is almost gone okay Oh, let me face mist while I'm waiting. Some rose and witch hazel water. Ooh, child. Girl. 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 Girl, you kind of got it in my nose a bit. Yes, baby, let me face, face mist while I'm putting up dishes and stuff. So, typically, y'all, on a regular day... You know, obviously I got things to do. I'm going to start working on packing some stuff for my baby nephews for Christmas. Like, I'm going to start bagging their stuff. Um, that way I can kind of get it together. And whenever I get it together, I'll have to link up with my sister to get it to them. But, um, yeah. But, yeah, on a typical, like, day like now. I'm just going to run errands. I have errands to get handled. Like I said, I have a meeting tomorrow. So that's an important meeting. So I'll be up and ready for that. But I kind of just want to get some around the house things done today. She's Louise. This is like difficult to get off. Um, but yeah, I want to get some things done around the house. Um... Definitely get it clean back in here. Um, Y'all see like the couch is not even propped the right way. I moved the couch over. I was working on some stuff the other day and I kind of just... Sorry, I'm 
trying to peel this tag off. I was working on some stuff and then um, low-key just, yeah, I'd be moving my furniture all around. Like, I basically be moving my furniture to accommodate whatever I'm trying to do. So, yeah. So basically, that's what I'll be doing today. I'm still in the towel because I just got out. This time I just got out of the shower before I was getting into the shower. So, trying to let my face kind of dry out from the mist. I oiled my hair in the shower. I didn't put, I just finished off that vitamin E oil, so there's no more. So, my hair smells good. It smells fresh. It's got a little body, yaddy, yaddy. But it feels fresh. My face looks like it's getting rejuvenated again, like it's coming back to itself. I mean, still some breakout. I went off the cycle, so of course some of that breakout's gonna go away. And then some of that extra breakout was just like your girl needed to get it together. I'm still getting it together, let's be clear. I'm not gonna put on any makeup today, like at all, because like I said, I'm really focusing on just trying to get my skin back where I need it to be. Um I'll have on makeup tomorrow, of course, but today, no, 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 no. Oh, let me pull this back down. So let me get to my uh, things I need to get done. I'm going to play some music, and I'll see y'all in, like, a little bit later. Okay, hey, y'all. So I um, went to run my errands. I'm actually back home, so I'm going to be... Why was I going to look for my phone, and I'm recording off of my actual phone instead of my camera? So... I just got back home. Um, I'm going to be doing some like extreme cleaning. Like I told you guys, I have a really important meeting tomorrow. Super excited about that. I already got my half and half tea from Chick-fil-A. Y'all know I don't play about my um, tea. So I already got that. Um, I'm about to actually go clean up and stuff like that. And I'm going to get some work done. I got to charge my still got to charge my camera battery. I like to uncharge everything before I leave the house, so I've already uncharged it, but I felt like like I wanted to go for a walk or something because it's so pretty outside, but I'm not 100% sure that I'm going to do that just because I have things to do. Um, so I've been like real busy, but like I said, I think the most important thing right now is to get inside the house and actually clean up and get my stuff together um, to get prepared for the week. I have a lot of things that I need to get done. A lot of things I'm supposed to be doing. Y'all, this eternal water was buy one, get one free yesterday from Publix, if anybody wants to know. I normally get Essentia, and I've been liking the new smart water, the black one. Like, the, it's clear with the black label. But I picked this up because it was buy one, get one free. And how many fluid ounces is this one? Jesus, weird. I normally see the fluid ounces, like, the first thing on the bottle. Surprisingly, unless I'm like blind, I don't see the fluid ounces on this bottle. But anyway, they were buy one, get one free. So I have a whole big one in the, and they were $1.99 in the house. But I think natural resources should be free. Like it's so crazy. Like they charge you for everything. Like we should have access across the world for clean water, feminine products and condoms and all of these things that you need those types of things should be free you know women shouldn't have to pay for tampons and pads like we didn't you know what I mean like these are things that I feel like should just come with the world these should be free resources but that's neither here nor there um but yeah I'm gonna get to work I don't know about y'all but I get excited about cleaning up sometimes because I just know that my space is about to be tidied and it's about to smell good it's about to smell like fabuloso Oh, I was watching on Netflix this show called, or this movie called Ava. If you haven't watched it and you are and you like like action movies, it's a female assassin. Watch that movie on Netflix, Ava. I was kind of mad how it ended. I'm thinking maybe there will be a sequel, like a part two or something. But I don't know. And January kind of needs to get here because I'm ready to pick up season three of you. Um, if you haven't been watching you, then you need to go ahead and watch the show you. There's two seasons out right now, and the third is coming out in January. Um, Blood and Water, I think, is another show. I watched season one. I'm waiting for season two to come out. That's like, that's like, you know, that's an interesting show as well. Um, 
but yeah so i feel like today is going to be super productive i'm going to get some reading done some work done prepare for my meeting tomorrow i'm going to clean up i'm going to get this video posted at some point probably going to just do check-ins vlogmas day 14 is not that you know pop in but uh, make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel make sure you remember that we're doing a 500 subscriber luxury giveaway and then we're also doing the um shape by the shake women's best meal replacement so if you're interested in any of those then make sure you um comment let me tuck my necklaces in because for right now i kind of feel like a pastor with chains you know how the pastors some of the pastors be trying to wear their luxury because my neckline i don't know y'all i don't know I don't know where I'd be coming up with these theories, but a baby. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to get some things done. Um, I need to call my sister back, so I'm going to probably do that as well. Uh, I feel like there's a lot of other things I have to do, but that's neither here nor there for the video. Things are going to get done. My, oh, my professor responded back to me and stated that I will not be penalized for a shortage of pages just I'd be penalized if I would have exceeded the number of pages that he said don't go beyond then also my academic peti petition academic standing petition that I submitted basically well I submitted an original petition it got denied which I knew it was gonna first get denied because I submitted a petition in the past that got denied and the reason was my MBA degree was conferred when I already took that class so I'm hoping that my advisor could submit the academic standing petition for me and we can get results back and I hope that it's in my favor because if it's in my favor it's only up from here um, which means that I'll be concluding my program sooner than later so I mean, I haven't taken any semesters off and I haven't failed anything, so I'm right on track, but I'm also going to graduate earlier than the expected person because I go and do my classes year round. So I'm waiting to find out what they say. Um, yeah, but outside of that, like everything's going well. I feel like I'm right on track with my goals. I've been setting bigger goals and things like that for the upcoming year. I definitely believe that, you know, my brand is going to go places. It's going to expand. Um, so I'm really, really optimistic about it. I am, you know, just trying to put all my energy and all of the good positive vibes into my brand. Not really focused on too much outside of that. Um, not really focused on hanging with too many people either. Um, I've been saying that a lot and I mean that because it's like I need to put the attention into myself. Um... I always catch a vibe by myself somewhere a lot of times because I like to think, I like to network, I like to do those things. And sometimes being around people is a distraction. Like when it's not for the greater cause of ex like succeeding and stuff like that, sometimes it's a distraction. Um, so that's why sometimes you might catch me out by myself. Like you might see the, the, you, the uh, story videos on my YouTube, but what you don't know is I have a laptop and I have all of my you know, planners and agendas and stuff like that right next to me, making, go setting goals and, you know, basically handling work. So my, prof my advisor is in compliance and email with me right now. So we're going back and forth and, um, I'm not sure what she's staring at, but hi. Um, so me and my advisor have kind of been like in compliance. Like, so we're talking right now and I'm trying to get her to submit the standing, um academic petition on my behalf just because like me having to print it out fill it out send it back all that that's just a little too much when she already has the form and she could do it on my behalf i mean she's an advisor that's what they do um obviously i like to be independent as well but with me having such a busy schedule right now that's just not something that i'm going to actually pursue right now unless she says i don't have the ability to do it then i'm gonna have to stop everything i'm doing to do it because this is something that I'm trying to get a reply back before Christmas break or before the new year so that I can properly set my upcoming schedule um, based off of that. Because right now we have a schedule that's set up for my remaining courses, but there's a way that we can actually shorten the time if this petition is approved. Um, so I'm real optimistic if they deny it for the second time, y'all already know I'll appeal it and I'll submit another petition because I don't believe in you know having to do things more than once when it doesn't make sense so no like if you want me to take business entities um or something like that but i have a whole background in business plus my profession is in business like that's just a course that's not necessary like i already have 
experience that outweighs that in the classroom and out the classroom. So I'm hoping that they would see it in my perspective. My advisor definitely said she didn't have anything to add to my petition because she felt like I nailed it. Like I thoroughly nailed the explanation, the rationale as to why that should be substituted. So we'll see. I'll keep you guys up to date as I always give you guys like a grad school update um, as far as weight. I weighed in this morning at 155.2 pounds. Um, yesterday I was 153.2, but like those past two days before today, the previous ones, I wasn't eating like that. Like I ate salads and stuff, but I didn't, I just didn't have appetite like that. So now I'm back to 155.2. The other day I was 154.8. So it's just a fluctuation. Again, I told you guys, I'm trying to kind of, you know, bring it down. So Starting tomorrow, we'll be just like, you know, really focusing again, as I always have these moments where I'll reset and do a cleanse or, you know, like fast throughout the week. So we'll see what I end up doing, but I'll probably end up checking back in with y'all later um, before I actually upload this. I will definitely check in and just give y'all like a finalized update. I did a video last night, which I'm not sure if I'm going to upload it, but it was a cook with me slash talk with me. But I don't know if I'm going to upload that video or not. Um, but this one will definitely be uploaded. And of course, I will close out the vlog. It will be uploaded before midnight for you lovely people who have to be asleep. So you can be up for work or you just don't get to watch videos at midnight. So I'll have it posted. Make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next video. Okay, so hey, babes, I'm going to close out the vlog now. Um... I'm still going to just get things done around the house. I think I'm going to make me um, something to drink. I don't know if... I don't know. Because I was kind of trying to figure out, like, what do I want? Do I want a matcha? I might make me some sparkling water or something like that. Some 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 basic. Because um, I'm about to get with it when it comes to cleaning. Like, I'm about to start in the bathroom. Um, I don't know if I'm going to do my hair. Like... Obviously, I got to do it for tomorrow, but I might just throw it in a bun and just slick my edges without retwisting. Um, but I'm not 100% sure. But I do know that I'm about to start cleaning the bathroom because it's about that time. Give the bathroom a good scrub. I'll probably take another shower because once I scrub the shower, I don't like to just be walking around smelling like shower chemicals. So I'm going to go ahead and start spraying my shower walls and then I'm going to get in the shower and scrub down as well. So let me go ahead and get with it y'all because y'all know I don't play about my cleanup. I turn on some music and I vibe out. Period. So that's what I'm about to do. Uh, make sure you guys like this video, comment, share, subscribe and I'll see y'all in the next video. I have such a bad habit chewing on my top, my pen, my pen tops. Um, such a bad habit chewing on straws. I have stopped doing pen tops a long time ago because a pen exploded in my mouth and literally the ink was all over my teeth. I had blue ink all over my teeth and I'm like rinsing my mouth out, like hoping that I don't swallow the ink because it's like, bruh, that can be poisonous. So I literally cleared out my mouth. My tongue was blue, like everything. And then I brushed my teeth and I just kept brushing, brushing, brushing and spitting and spitting. And I kind of learned my lesson from chewing pens. Like, I would, I would chew the caps, and then I would start chewing the back of the pins. Like, I don't know. I just did. And even now, I still chew straws. I try to do better, but I still chew straws and caps and stuff like that. Um, not good for you, but it's just a bad habit that I have. So, let me start working on better habits. Um, but, yeah. So, I'm about to give that bathroom a... I'm talking about when you walk in this, baby, it's about to be so clean that... You, you, you're not even going to want to walk on the floor. It's going to be that clean. Excuse me. I picked up some more like razors and some soap and stuff like that. There's still some other household items that I need to pick up. But for the most part, I've picked up what's needed for the bathroom. I have extra toilet paper. Um, I've been getting through the products. Remember I told you I had like a whole bunch of products that I set aside to just get through so that I can get rid of. Um, I pretty much have finished those pro uh, products off and some of them are almost done face wash I should be done with that face wash probably over the next couple days and um yeah like everything is clearing out my face actually doesn't look too bad but make sure you guys like comment share subscribe and I'll see y'all in the next video later it's only a little something